welcome to another great year at Campus Middle School, home of the Mustangs. An important component of a successful experience at CMS is to get involved. Campus Middle School offers a few athletic opportunities for its students. We have track, basketball, wrestling, and girls volleyball. Another great way to get involved at CMS is to join and participate in a club or activity. Campus Middle School believes strongly in our tenets of Aspire. Mustangs are accountable, safe, purposeful, inclusive, respectful, and excellent. Campus Middle School opens at 8 a.m. You may go into the library for homework, quiet study hall, or go into the cafeteria for breakfast. Students must stay in the library or cafeteria until dismissed at 8.35. If you are leaving to go see a teacher before 8.35, you must have a blue hallway pass. You must also have a hallway pass if you're going to the nurse, counselor, dean, library, or any time you are leaving a classroom during class time. You must have a signed pass to be allowed to leave the cafeteria during lunch recess or during morning breakfast study time. Always go to your class first before you go to another office or location. Courtyard doors and the end of the seventh grade hall will be open at 835. If you are dropped off early, please proceed to the front entrance to enter the cafeteria or quiet study hall area. State law requires shoes to be worn at all times. We want all attire to be respectful here at Campus Middle School. Dress that is dangerous or distracting and clearly interferes with the learning environment will not be tolerated. No hats, hoods, bandanas, slippers, or costumes are allowed. Hats are allowed during lunch and recess, but must never be worn in a hallway or a classroom. Clothing that depicts or promotes tobacco, alcohol, or drugs through its logo or message is not allowed. Clothing that may denote gang association or promote sexual, ethnic, racial harassment or intimidation will not be tolerated. Students wearing inappropriate clothing will be asked to change. If no appropriate apparel is available, the student will wait in the dean's office until a parent or guardian can provide a change of clothes. Backpacks and purses, including string packs and over-the-shoulder bags, are to remain in the student's locker at all times. Backpacks and purses are not permitted in any classroom. Students are not allowed to store their backpacks in the hallway at any time. The school is not responsible for lost or stolen items. Keep your phones and all electronic devices on you or locked in your locker at all times. Cell phones can be used before and after school, during lunch and recess, and when allowed from your classroom teacher. You cannot walk in the halls using your cell phones. This includes headphones and earbuds. You cannot take pictures or record any other student without their permission. Cell phones are to be used in class only during appropriate times and this will be communicated by your teacher. Lockers are property of Campus Middle School. You are borrowing this space. Please do not tell anyone your locker combination. All locks must be school issued. Do not add stickers, drawings, or marks on the outside or inside of a locker. This will be considered graffiti. Do not butterfly, alter, or mess with someone else's lock or locker. Students planning to decorate the outside of a locker for a friend's birthday must have permission, supervision, and a pass from a teacher. No more than three students working on a locker at a time. Lockers that are decorated must be respectful and appropriate. Decorations must be taken down within three school days. It is your responsibility to keep your belongings safe and secure at Campus Middle School. Ensure to always lock your bike hallway locker, and PE locker. Always lock your bike on the designated bike racks only. Theft is taking another person's property without that person's permission or consent with the intent to deprive the rightful owner of it. Consequences for theft 
will be suspension from school and a ticket from the Greenwood Village Police Department. Students must always have their IDs on them at all times. IDs are used to ride the bus, check out books and resources in the library, check out equipment during recess, and more. If you lose your ID, please go to the library's media center to have another ID printed. New IDs cost $5. Late buses are Monday through Thursday. There will be no late buses on Friday afternoon. All students must leave Friday by 3.50. If you are riding the late bus, you must stay with your club, activity, teacher, or sport until 4.45. You must have a late bus pass to ride the late bus. Students are not permitted to leave campus after school and come back to ride the late bus. If you do not have a pass, you may be asked to wait at school until a parent or guardian can come pick you up. Unfortunately, sometimes bad choices are made. We need to make sure we learn from these choices. If you receive a referral, you may have a consequence for your behavior. These may range from lunch detention, after school detention, out of school suspension, or possible expulsion. A suspension is when the school feels your behavior is severe enough that you need to stay home from our campus middle school community. Examples of why you may be suspended from school are fighting, up to five days out of school, possible behavior contract, and Greenwood Village Police Department will be notified. Drug or alcohol use, possession, or selling. This includes over-the-counter and prescription drugs unless given by the school nurse. Interfering with the school's ability to provide educational opportunities to other students. Harassment. This could be verbal, physical, cyber, or sexual. Theft. Or threats. Verbal, written, cyber, direct, or indirect. The most serious consequence a student can receive is an expulsion. Some examples of why you may be expelled from the Cherry Creek School District are selling or or distributing of drugs or controlled substances, robbery or assault, bringing and or using dangerous weapons or facsimiles, this means using an object as a weapon or pretending an object is a weapon, or behavior on or off school property that is detrimental to the safety and welfare of others. We hope all students at Campus Middle School will be upstanders and do the right thing to help ensure CMS is a safe, caring, and excellent community for all to grow and learn. If you suspect you or another student are in danger, please report immediately to a teacher and or another adult in the building to help you. If you are having issues outside of school hours or outside of the school property, please notify your parents and they can contact the appropriate police department to assist you. We look forward to another amazing year at Campus Middle School. Home in the Mustangs, 